The following program is a presentation of the Provincial Educational Media Center. Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games. And I like the intro. You thought that was funny. I did. I, I only just caught it from the side, though, because I was dealing with a cat issue. So <laughs> What the hell what was, was that? that? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to learn stuff here. Yeah. Uh, just something funny I ran across. Thought I'd throw it in the that intro. Is, that is pretty funny. Uh, we're going to be playing Atari tonight, as per usual. Yay! Atari Homebrew, specifically... A Jaguar game, Atari Jaguar, Gravitic Mines mm -hmm. from Reboot, and Atari H. Mm -hmm. um, and we have the developer in the chat tonight, uh, Lawrence Stavely, uh, Cyrano J. So if you have any questions about the game or we uh, have questions about how to play certain levels, then that will be very, very handy. Um, so I want to thank all the people tuning in and all the subscribers scrolling down the side. 8-Bit Swami, Alnifer, Arkham H, Armscar Coder, Atari 8 x 100 l Rules, Atari 1974, Atari 8, BR Poker, Buck Owens, Charles and Check, Charles Wynn, Chai 574, Cubanismo, Drexel, Dr. Mukaus, Fox, Muller, Great Defender, Ground Drooper, Orgy Rapper, Johnny WC, Carl G, Ken Jennings, Invader, Kev Kelly, Lauren TDZ, Marco Yanis, Mark Spacing, Metal Atari 969, Mick Muse, Mike Soul, Mike Littell, Miss Command, Mr. Zarno, Will Mr. Fix, Muddy Funster, Nathan Strum, Packer, VG Koag, RC70, Render Ghost, Repentless, VG, Ricardo, Pim, Six, Sweet, Sledgehammered, Spitty Bee, Smitty Bee, not Spitty Bee, uh, Spiceware, Spitty Bee, <laughs> uh, uh, S. Ramirez, The Lost Cartridge, The Welshman, 8090, Dan K, Tfos, Trek, and DX, Hen X, and if you would like to support the channel, just click on subscribe. It's free if you have Amazon Where Prime. It? Where is it? Just Somewhere. like Alnifer, Danny to see an 8-bit Swami did just before the show. Nice. Thank you so much. <laughs> I have a poll question tonight related to the Jaguar. Very uh, straightforward uh, question. It is... Let's start the poll. Um, do you have one? <laughs> I don't think I've asked this. Um, one for yes. Two for no, but I plan on getting one eventually. Mm -hmm. uh, three, no, they're too expensive. <laughs> that means you want to get one, but, but no. <laughs> it's expensive. Or four, just not planning to get one. Mm. And I do have one because that's what we're playing on. Yay. So one. There you go. And they are a uh, five. You used, used to, to have, have one. one. I, I didn't have that option. That would fall under no, I don't have yes. one. And do you plan on getting one again? Mm -hmm. um, they are expensive. Probably one of the most expensive systems I have bought. Really? I mean... More expensive oh, than the Vectrix? The yeah. The Vectri? Vectri. I think the I Vectri? got those for $250 each. Oh, back in the day. But they're back in the quite day. pricey so now. You have to account... I got them in like 97 oh, Yeah, <laughs> so, okay. They're a little bit more now. Not, yeah. not a whole <laughs> a lot more, but uh, a little bit more. Um, yeah, even less than like the Turbo Graphics Super Effects mm -hmm. game uh, system, which is not many people are interested in because there's only 16 games. But mm -hmm. uh, yeah, they're they're for pretty expensive. Yeah. Um, but I'm glad I got one because then I can play all the awesome pro homebrew like we're going to be playing tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, I have some mail. And it is right here. Ooh. I did actually get it last show, but it's more appropriate to open it today. Oh, why would that I be? I think. I think. Mm -hmm. If it is what it is, which it is. Because <laughs> I, 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 I track it, so... Mm. Fair enough. Make sure things get to where they're supposed to go. I think I've got it open here. I keep getting distracted because there's cat fighting going on over over in the side here. Oh, hear cat them fighting. Hear them tumbling and fighting. Oh, so much fun. <laughs> Atari does get fed up with Sprite. Oh, he gets so fed up with You'll that. probably hear hissing. He's, he's playing right now, so yeah, he's okay. They, they're not really aggressive or anything with each other, but they do get fed up. So, almost got it fully open here. Wow, that's a lot of packing. Yep. Oh, no. I ripped it. <laughs> here we go. Two items in here. Put this box to the side. Let's see. 
Let's... Wait, you spent 110 for a Vectrix in 98? That seems like a good deal. That's a very good deal. For a replacement Vectrix, but well, still. still a Vectrix. It's not <laughs> a broken it's one. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you for following Evil Rhino? Evil Arino? It's probably not the way you pronounce Arino. it. Arino? Evil Arino? Oh, evil Arino. Uh, Miss Command says, Factory Seal Vectrix, three grand. Grab now on eBay. Uh, Whoa. Well, I'm, I'm happy Factory with my open sealed. ones that I can play. Yeah. And speaking of Vectrex. Mm. Ooh. There we go. What does that mean, I wonder? Means Will a we be Vectrix playing show some Vectrix games might be coming in the near up. Yes. Yeah, so. Let me see. I haven't seen be it. Good for up there. <laughs> oh, it's nice. Is it the same artist who it did is. the other ones? It is the exact same artist wow. that did the other ones. That one's wood, though. The other ones are. Um. um, um like resin, resin or plastic, yeah. Yeah. Acrylic. Uh, That's acrylic. the term I'm looking for. Yes. Yeah. And the other one I got. I know it is snazzy. That we'll be using That's really tonight. Nice. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at that Ooh. shininess. Jaguar. Beautiful. You should shout out who uh, made them. I don't have that. You don't handy. have that info. <laughs> Find Not that handy. info. So yeah. Roar. Yeah, exactly. Roar. That looks. That is really nice. I love nice. the shine on it. Yeah, I yeah, need to. I think we need. Really, really do you good. have the control for the lights? I'll, I'm going to switch it to yeah. red because I feel oh. like the red is an is that a necessity. Would that would work. Let's see. Um. Yeah. I don't oh. know where I got them from, but if you look for Jaguar signs on eBay. Or like the Atari 2600 signs, like just look for those and uh, you'll find them. And he also sells them not on eBay. I don't know if the, how the prices are different. I couldn't order it to Canada from his website. Um, and I couldn't order the Jaguar one initially through eBay either. Oh, really? So I emailed him and said, hey, I can't order the Jaguar. And he put it up on eBay and, and oh, changed so it so it. I could order it. Oh, so well, that's right. He's very responsive. Uh, to the messages. This, this, on the other hand, is not very responsive. Um, it does some weird things sometimes. The colors are a little bit off on the remote, too. Well, no, no, it's not. Oh, it picked yellow. Okay, I got yellow. Oh, I didn't even notice the Atari Fuji in the A of Jaguar. Very nice. Is there? Nice little touch. Yeah, it's very, very subtle. Because it oh, there. blends right in. Ah. Um, so there's a new icon for our new kitten. So if you look in the icons and go to zero page, there's a new icon for Sprite. Now he was named after the Soot Sprite on My Neighbor Totoro. <laughs> and so that's what the Soot Sprites look like. Yeah. So I've just put in a Soot Sprite yeah. for Sprite. And it's, it's, it's just cute. little eyeballs. <laughs> and, and that's what he is. Like in the he dark, is. that's what he looks like. Yeah. <laughs> Especially just if you're looking at him straight on, just Aww. a fluff ball with eyeball oh, with he's eyes. So he doesn't have white eyes because uh, well, he has yellow. They're yellow, but that's pretty close. Yeah. <laughs> um, so on to the news. We um, there's a new cartridge format coming out for the Atari 7800, made by um, Eagle and Raphael. Raphael? F R A F A L. Oh, look at that. Gifted a sub to Serrano Reboot. There Thank you, you, Tom. Thank you for subbing Serrano J. Yeah, that's <laughs> From awesome. From Tom, uh, eight, uh, 182. Um, so this uh, cartridge format is um, 32K of RAM up to. 32K of RAM, or it is, just straight up is. 32K of RAM, 512 uh, K of ROM. Mm. It also includes two uh, sound chips on it. Not a pokey. It, uh, the sound chip is an SN76489AN mm. plus a Kovox. Um, so looking up here, let me play you the music from that. Oh, thank you so much. From uh, Anonymous Gifters. <laughs> <laughs> Anonymous Gifter gave Cat 000000000. zero 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 zero. I remember that name from before. Do you? When they um, when they followed, I remember saying all the zeros. Oh, zeros. nice. <laughs> um, so this is an example from um, uh, 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 Eagle using the chip. Mm. There you go. Cybernoid two.
so um, the uh, audio chip has uh, three square wave tone generators, a wide range of frequencies. Let's just go back mm -hmm. here. Um, 16 different volume levels, one noise generator, two types, white noise and periodic. Mm -hmm. I don't know what uh, periodic noise sounds like. <laughs> Uh, three different frequencies, 16 different volume levels. Uh, here's a rundown of the chip. Uh, Texas mm -hmm. Instruments SN76489. Um, and it was used in a ton of stuff. Uh, for home computers and consoles, it was used in the... Uh, let's make that a little bit bigger. ColecoVision, IBM PC Junior, Neo Geo Pocket in Color, uh, Game Gear, uh, Genesis, Sega Master System, Sega Pico, Tandy 1000, TI 99, a ton of uh, home computers and consoles. Also used in a bunch of arcade games as well. Uh, Mr. Do's Castle, Mr. Do, Ladybug, um, Russian Attack, and a bunch of uh, Sega. I guess those are more like boards rather than specific games. Mm. So, uh, Zaxxon, there you go. Mm -hmm. System 1, System 2, System E, probably lists all the different games that are under it. Let's see. Maybe not. No. I don't know what that's... Oh, it did on the side there. Oh, here they are. Just tons. Tons and tons and tons. That's why they, they listed them as boards, not games. It's just <coughs> too many. Tons. Let's see, Wonder Boy and Monster oh, wow. Land. Michael Jackson in Scramble Training. What? That's a bizarre uh, title. Okay. Oh, we won't read that. <laughs> we're getting into a, a, a hole on uh, Wikipedia there. <laughs> but anyway, that is a, a cool new um, format that uh, they are making. But when somebody asked, how can I get one? The reaction was just a laugh emoji. <laughs> Because I think they're making it specifically <laughs> for one game, for themselves. And they plan on making Robo 7, uh, 7800, or Robo, mm. which is a port of, um, of a game. I can't remember what it was originally on, but it's been put on, on the 8-bit cute. system yeah. uh, and tons of other uh, systems. So there's a, like you have to set up bombs and you get shot and you get those little screws to fix your ufo to take off to the next level seems very puzzly a little bit of action feels mm -hmm. a little petsky robot-y but um... well, <laughs> a, a tiny bit i guess but it, it's it's a robot i mean in petsky robots you're not the robot the robots are the robots they're, they're the bad guys you're the good guy True. in this one so uh that is very something to look forward to nice yeah um yeah there where he posted it April 23rd about the game itself. Mm. Almost done. I test on Dragonfly. Uh, I'm looking for uh, graphicians? Graphic graphians? Graphicians? I don't know. Yeah. Uh, it feels like some of you played on the channel. I yes. think I played it on... Oh, I played it on the Atari 2600. Mm. Oh, what is the name of it on the 2600? A really, really good version of it. It'll come to me later. Is a Z in it? <laughs> Something like that uh, by somebody who, oh, I wish made more and more, a lot more games oh, and yeah. finished that one. Yeah. Um, so that is almost done. And they posted that uh, a couple days ago, the, the picture of the chip. Let's see. Here it is. How to buy and how to program that cart. That's it. Just a laughing <laughs> emoji. Just ha ha ha. <laughs> so I guess they're not going to be selling it at all. They're or just, not yet, maybe. Not yet. Yeah. Robo Mechanic. There it is. Amazing yeah. game. Nice. Oh, we played, I think, every single level of Robo Mechanic. Yeah. To date. He's going to make more of them. Oh, okay. And he was stuck on, like, compressing the levels down to include them all, but then somebody was helping him compress the levels, so I'm not worried. I don't know where he's at now with that, so okay. hopefully that's coming uh, soon. Um, a new analog Atari 5200 joysticks are being developed. There we go. Um, so there are not many options for analog 5200 joysticks, 
And Lucas Lack posted uh, two days ago mm -hmm. about some that he's developing, and he's developing ones that are the exact same form factor as the original 5200 controllers. Okay. So you can use the overlays in them. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, so here's a picture of his 3D printed, and that, that's the one on the right is his compared to the original oh, on the I left. Oh, I see. It's nice. Yeah, very, very, very nice. Very clean and black. I mean, I assume yep. there might be... Um, he has moved stickers or something. He's moved on there, one but... thing. He's moved the um, pause and start to and the bottom there. Whatever the other button is. Yeah. Uh, down to the bottom. Yeah. And yeah. he shows the uh, overlay in it. Stuck on. Yeah. 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 Um, and he's got really, really, really wide, thick buttons, which is good. Yes. Because the original ones were super tiny yeah. and very hard to use. Um, so I don't know why I included that picture. It's a very blurry picture. <laughs> Maybe he's hiding what's inside, and it's like, oh yeah, there's wires, but I'm not going to show you. I don't know. No, then they showed yeah. ones with lots of wires. I don't know. Um, so, let's see. Uh, he said, I've spent... Let me just go up to a picture. I've spent better part of a year and a half developing a replacement controller for the Atari 5200 in my infrequent spare time, and I hope that this will be a reasonable, pl reasonable place to discuss my both my personal progress, future prospects, and what I th should be thinking about in future development of the controller. Um, some aspects of it, it's self-centering, mm -hmm. analog joystick, so it goes back to Which the center. Which Vitoko was just asking. Yes, it Hi, does Vitoko. have an auto Hola. Hola. Um, <laughs> It does have an <laughs> auto, auto center, center which yeah. is very important because the original I didn't. So if you put it to the side, it would just stay there. Yeah. Um, especially with digital games that you have to play on it, it would feel more digital with the auto sense, uh, centering. Um, uh, the joystick is not working yet. He hasn't mm. got that working, but he's got all the buttons working on it. The mm. um, exact same form factor as the original. Well, not exactly, because he's moved some buttons. Um, the price point is approximately $75, plus shipping and handling, yeah. which I looked up Best Electronics, and they're at $99. So it's quite, a, quite cheaper than the original joysticks refurbished. Okay. Refurbished. Because okay. you will not find a non-refurbished working 5200 controller. Mm. It's just not happening. You're very, very lucky. Um, he'll be selling them through eBay. Uh, eight controllers will be ready midsummer, mm. so very soon. It's midsummer today, or is it the no, beginning no, 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 of summer? No, no. Beginning, beginning of, of summer. summer. Yep. Yeah, it's June twenty first. It is oh, the solstice right. it today. It is the solstice. I didn't even realize um, that. Sixteen to twenty four more available mid September, and then on demand after that. Mm. So they'll be ramping up. CNN. Okay. Fat finger the keyboard while eating <laughs> yeah. dessert. Um, so this is really, really uh, cool for the people who like that original form factor. Mm -hmm. of like, um, like the authenticity of authenticity. playing games with that original. Console. I have uh, a number of adapters that will adapt uh, digital joysticks mm. to the Atari 5200, and I have one analog joystick as mm. well. So maybe I'll pick one of these up, mm. just to have a secondary one. Yeah. Yeah, just to have a, a, a second one because there there will be some games that will have need for two analog analog game nice. uh, joysticks. Yeah, yeah. Um, he hasn't started a list yet of people for to keep track of people who are ordering them. Mm. But people are like, I would like one. I would like one. So I might <laughs> just put my name on on here. Um, yeah, he just updated today about the details that I said uh, eight hours ago. Um, so that is it for the news. Mm -hmm. Time to get into the game. It's definitely the first day of summer. 88. 31. That's a nice, nice. That actually sounds really nice. Depends it's on been the fairly, humidity. Fairly chill, chilly here, but that's, uh, that's Vancouver in June. It gets, cool. doesn't get warmer. We don't get warm streaks until July and August. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, it's cool. It's, it's kind of chilly. It's under 20 like it's not oh it's under warm. 20 yeah, yeah. It's, yeah it's, it's cool it's right just under 20 yeah. for the most part which is yeah. fun what can you do yeah, yeah. it's, it's <laughs> better than better than the heat dome so oh, hopefully no more oh, of those oh please no yeah the show will not be happening if the, <laughs> the heat, the heat dome because we had to not do the show last year because i of remember it. that yeah we had to not do it for like a week and i posted like the temperature yeah and it was like 40 i think oh it was crazy it was very bad and yeah. it's very humid here do? too I, we, we would we have nowhere to go. We'd have to be in here yeah. to do the show. Yeah. So it's impossible. Like, just just not possible. <laughs> it's just not possible. We could yeah. chat. Is Darcy's, is Darcy's uh, um, store uh, in the back uh, air-conditioned at all? 
<laughs> it pr it would have to be mm. right. Yeah. Yep. Uh, oh yeah. Start. Pause. Reset. Nice. Um, okay. Time to get to the game today, which is Gravitic Mines mm. on the Jaguar. Um, we showed this off on Atari Age Day. We went through all the uh, extras you get with the because um, there's two versions that they put out. The standard version, yes, and the I don't know what they would call it, extreme version. <laughs> I can't remember what the they call it. Version. Ultimate version. <laughs> let me uh, let me look it up so you guys can deluxe see. Deluxe, deluxe version. Deluxe ultimate. Uh, Atari Age and Gravitic Mines. Yeah. So you can take a look at it. I I don't know where the extra bonus stuff is. Um, so you can buy this game in the Atari Age store right now. Here it is, deluxe. So you can get it in gray. Or you can get it, here's the gray one, or you can get a clear one for extra $5, mm. deluxe edition, uh, $60, because you get a lot of stuff. And you can add a pro controller, which I 100% um, endorse getting a pro controller. Yeah. Because we'll, we'll talk about that when we're playing it. Yeah. But it's got two shoulder buttons mm. and three more extra buttons on the top for controls. Mm. Um, so I would definitely go for the Jaguar Pro Controller yeah. if you do not have one yeah. already. Yeah. Um, so with the deluxe version, you get, um, I mean, you get the overlay in all of them, I believe. Yeah. Um, you get the poster with the deluxe, you get the soundtrack CD, and it has great music. Yeah, it does. It really does. Yeah. Like, it's impressive when you're playing. Really it's impressive. really, really nice music. Uh, you get a patch and a keychain. Nice. You get stickers. You get a baseball cap. You get a reboot coin. So nice. you get a ton of stuff yeah. for all the extra extras that uh, you get with the deluxe, deluxe version. Mm -hmm. Oh, and there's the um, clear, oh, killer like case. Clear. Very nice. <laughs> So nice. I just got the gray one. Yeah, gray's nice too. <laughs> I, I didn't get to pick. <laughs> it was sent to me by Al, so. Um, now we're going to play. Let's pop it in. Mm -hmm. Actually, before we do that, um, this was this game was originally announced um, February 25th, 2019. Um, and this was the first video that they posted about the game. This is the first look that they gave, March 2nd, 2019. Oh, really? Yeah, so there's your it's ship. Just it's a just a red a, ship, a red, a, a red, um, a red triangle. triangle. Yeah. yeah. Look at it, the backgrounds are already there. The though. background's pretty much, I'm sure it's been spruced up, but same idea. Yeah. There's nothing to do on this level. He's just flying around. Yeah. I feel old. Don't feel old, Cyrano. It's Is okay. it because we're just talking about <laughs> weather? Because that's basically what old people do all the, the other uh, day my long. aching bones yeah. in the weather. It's 31 degrees right Back now. Back in my day. Tomorrow it's going to be 32. <laughs> we played games with one button and we liked it. <laughs> <laughs> So this is this is the original. Um, or when when did this come out? Uh, this video, this sneak preview video, oh, is March second. Is that why Serrano says I feel old? <laughs> Get <laughs> it's off not my that lawn. Long. Get off my no, lawn. No, it's not that long ago. Yeah. Three, three years. No. It takes a long time to program. Oh yeah. <laughs> great games, um, especially one with this much in it. Oh, oh my yeah. goodness. Uh, and have a team to do it too. Mm -hmm. um, so that is what it looked like in uh, March 2019. Mm. It came out, it was shipped this year, a couple months ago, recently. Uh, it's a six meg game, but in raw form, it's 43 megs. So they've 43. really squished it okay. down, 43 to six. So Ooh, it really? uh, squished down, good compression. That is good compression. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I think we're good to play. Let's do it. Let's pop it in. I'm, I'm reading everyone's uh, forecasts. Well, not forecasts. Current temperatures where they are. A lot of hot weather out east, it seems. Illinois. Oh. Cold in Ch Chile, uh, according Chile? to... Chile? <laughs> oh, Chile? in Chile. I in thought Chile. You, thought you meant Chile. Uh, according to Victoco. Um, Sorry. <laughs> I am curious. So let's take a look at the poll before we go away, because I'll probably forget. Um, so in fourth place, not planning to get one. Yeah. Uh, with 46%, uh, 30% have one. So one out of the okay. three people have one. And 15% uh, know they're too expensive. And 7% know, but I'm planning to get one eventually. Yeah. So. And there, there are a couple go. of fives and people saying they used to have one. Used to have one. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, 84 that, that, now, 930. Gosh. Whoa. Yeah. It's warm out there. 
I, I, a lot of people <laughs> up, upgrade their systems as they went along. So they're like, okay, I want to get the new one. So yeah. I sell off the old it's one, true. get some it's trade true. in amount. Or something breaks and then that you're like, too. oh, well, we're yeah. done. Yeah. Okay. So let's take a look again. Oh, at least with Trevor too, so we can see it booting up. Let's hope there's no red screen of death. It's happening. There we go. Yay. Oh yeah, because it bypasses. Atari Age, who's the distributor for the game. Australia's cool, but that would be expected. Isn't it winter in Australia right yeah, now? Yeah, like height of almost, High of winter. It, wouldn't it be the winter, winter solstice? <laughs> yeah. Is it? Gravitic yeah. mines. A game by L. Stavely and A. Lex. Oh, that was too fast. Okay. Uh, published in the USA under license by www.atariage.com. Very nice. And we'll get that first screen. I think there's just two. Nope. M Mission dialogue written and edited by Andrew Rosa. Mm. Or Rosa. All music composed by Roald Strauss, licensed from. Ah! <laughs> Something you can rewind and pause. Yeah. Audio engine by Linkovich, u235.co.uk. Got to give credit mm -hmm. where credit's due. Sound mm -hmm. effects generated by BFX, bfxr.net. Mm. Um, because I believe in the Jaguar, it's all it's like, there's, is there a sound chip in it? Is there a sound chip in the Jaguar where you can like, like do waveforms and stuff, or is it all recorded? Mm -hmm. 2021 reboot. Yeah, very nice background artwork. Yeah. With the scrolling. Okay, let's all right. push B to play. So yesterday we ran through uh, the demos the or training. the training, yeah. so that we would not be completely embarrassed. Um, oh, go back, Albert. No, oh, uh, go back. I, I don't know why do Albert back? is on uh, C. No. No. There's bottom no two. Back. Together? Yeah. Nope, not here. You'll have to probably select Tanya. Yeah, I was. And then Tanya. and then go back. To what? Well, the main menu with all the info and stuff. No. <laughs> okay, go back. Down, down, down. Return. Uh, go to info. Info. Um, let's see credits. There's the full Very credits. Nice. Which which those were all the ones who read. Yes. Information hub. Oh, okay. Very nice. DSP audio processor, all digital. That's what I thought. Mm. Uh, Andrew Rosa is Mastercast TV. Mm. Oh, with thanks to a bunch of people <laughs> that I'm not going to read. You guys can read. Quite a few. There we go. Okay, Hardware. press the button. And go to return because we haven't done any scores no, or saves there's nothing or anything. In there. <laughs> nothing uh, in there miscellaneous. Ah, ah. so it's got a jukebox in it, so you can play all the music. Yeah. Um, I believe it has some like, and it has it louder. Nice. Nice. And I believe it says it had 35 minutes of music. Really? In the jukebox. In the, in, in the um, um, because we got the soundtrack, right? It's also on the soundtrack nice. as well, yeah. Click on a few of them. Techno trance. Nice. This is a nice little extra, actually. It is. Yeah. I mean, our next retro gaming um, uh, put on the background <laughs> uh, day, yep. which we, we hold here from time to time for friends. We'll just, yeah, put it on. Yep, put on some very retro nice. music. I try and put on music that's appropriate. Yep. This would be very appropriate. Okay, exit the jukebox. You can run it right off the Jaguar, too. Could. Yep. I don't have the CD add on for the Jaguar. That's expensive. Oh. Oof. No, you can play it right off the I game. I can, off the game, yeah. <laughs> but I was thinking, oh, put the CD in the CD. BJL? No, those are other things. Okay. That I have no idea about. Okay, return. Okay, return. All right. And go to options just to check them out before we do it. Uh, we won't change the controls because we're Can used to them. Can I click on them. it though? Yep. Oh, did you move down? What? No. I, I clicked. Oh. It looked like it moved down. Maybe it scrolled off. Uh, pad probably. That's what I had. Oh, okay. Um, oh, music. Go down. Looks like it shifts up a bit before that. 
much music do you want? Is that good? There? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Sound effects, they'll be the same. Just keep them the same. Actually, crank it up. These are... It's, the it's, sound effects? Yeah. And then go back to the music and crank it up a bit more. There. That, not too much. Down two. There. Good. And return. Excellent. Can you show off the modification to your controller? Yes, we'll show oh. um, the Pro Controller. Oh, yes. Um, I didn't mod it. It... You buy them like this. Um, there is a rotary controller that you can get as a mm. mod for this. Mm -hmm. I don't know anybody that sells the rotary controllers because I would like to get one because there's some games that um, you can use them with. So it's got two shoulder buttons that all these extra buttons emulate buttons down here so that they can work with any existing games. And then there's the three buttons up top those are all add-ons. So those are the extra buttons. You get five extra buttons that emulate five buttons down here. Um, super, super handy. And then you can get a rotary controller add-on that either goes, that replaces this, and another spot oops, that people have put it is on the back. And that's probably where I would put it because I have read about Tempest, and it does support the rotary, rotary controller, yeah. but on certain levels you have to use this as well oh so, you so if you've gotten both. rid of this yeah it's not going to work so what weren't you able to choose the pad here or am i thinking of no, something i've got else? an extra pad as well so you get one that sticks up like a joystick right yeah a thumbstick you i can get a thumbstick i did that to the other one do you have the other one to show off or uh yeah Is i've it shown available? it on the show before did you oh. i remember you doing it i don't remember you showing it off but yep 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 yeah I'll show the mod for that. Mm. And these are from Bratwurst. So this is the um, thumbstick mod that I did to one of my joysticks. So I have one original uh, three button and one modded three button. Nice. So if I ever feel that that is better for a game, like that would be better for free form moving games. Yeah. I would think platforming would be better with the D-pad. Yeah. So certain games are better. Mm -hmm. um, okay. All right. We're ready. Start. Not Albert. Not you Albert. You must have played this game <laughs> before he shipped it out. All right. Um, so we did the training. Yeah, we can't see if I remember the, anything. And now. we can't do the ace because we haven't... No. Haven't gotten ...made that, it there yet. That far yet. So we're going to start with level one. We did... I did play this last night. So oh. that's why level two is available. Oh. Do we want to start from scratch? Do you want to create uh, yeah, a, new, yeah. a new user? No, 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 no. Are we're, you sure? We're fine. You, we'll use yours. All right. Yeah. Uh, Planet Alpha, Hyperborean Nexus. Congratulations. You have managed to commandeer one of the enemy patrol ships in need of service. You need to disable the planetary defense system, pilot. We can't very well do that. Bad cat. Uh, <laughs> while running on fumes with minimal life support, munitions reports indicate supplies are scattered about the icy surface waiting for retrieval. Unless you collect at least one power core or one medical pod, the mission is over before it has begun. Get to work, though be wary. The Narl NX3, codenamed Centipede, is on patrol and I am fairly certain it will not like you. Good luck. So orbit required, yes. Extracts required, one. One. Okay. And I did this last so time, scared. so you can do it. I'm scared. It's not easy. Us. Uh, Cyrano says, Bratwurst D-pad replacement is excellent. So the controls in this game um, are... It's uh, B for the thrust. And then the shoulders uh, controls, which Tanya should be using, and she's not. <laughs> I know. I have to get my brain back around. Um do left and right thrust. Uh, the C button centers you again. Yeah. Oh. Oh, when we were playing this last night, I um, told Tanya about Space Taxi. Oh. <laughs> because if you did that in Space Taxi, it's a bad thing. You would land on the person and just, you'd squish them. You have to land beside the person. But of course, there's much wider pads in Space Taxi. Yeah, the graphics are awesome in this. And the music, of course. Oh, that was close. It's, so, it's, 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 um... so you have to disable that um, force field to get out of 
this level. Do you? So you have to go down to the Are bottom you sure? again. Oh yeah, we do. Yeah, it yeah. said right at the beginning, didn't it? Space taxi, definite favorite of mine. I'm waiting for somebody to um, finish Space Taxi for the 2600. There's there is one that had amazing start, and um, and it had a, actually there's a couple that had different different things going on, but uh, nobody's ever really finished a fully playable Space Taxi for the 2600. But it's completely doable. So I've seen some really good efforts. No. You're not using your thrusters. Oh my god, that was close. <laughs> Kittens, kittens, I don't need a cat. <laughs> Come on. I love you. Oh. Cyrano says, Ander did an uh, absolutely amazing job on the artwork. 100%. Like, even the background, you can shoot those. I saw the demo actually de destroy them. Um, like, look at the background. It's out of focus. And even stuff, there's like foreground background that's less out of focus, and then there's more background that's more out of focus. Yeah. It's like really this, thoughtful. Uh, yeah. Put a lot of thought put into that. Okay, do you want to do two? <laughs> um, do the next one. So this game also has, nice. if you press the button, or maybe you only get one. Nope, don't press it again. Don't press it again. Don't do it. Don't do it. Has, oh, it's so big. Has a high score, online high score table. Mm that you can upload your scores to, which I'm doing right now. Uh, statistics for current result, which I think Cyrano J just posted. Yeah. <laughs> um, average time, 19 seconds. Uh, accumulated time, 4 minutes, 38 seconds. Average crash is 0.14. Average rescue is 1. Um, this is the fastest time someone has completed it? Yeah. So oh, we wow. Don't think we made it. <laughs> no, but that's fine. I'm still uh, neat. With unlockable achievements. Yay. So, so we scanned that in. So you can do you can do number two. So now you move to the next this one. This was harder. I, I saw you do it. It was it was. Planet Alpha Hyborian yeah. Nexus. Much to my surprise, you survived. I did. Unfortunately, <laughs> on my surprise too. You almost crashed. Yeah. Uh, unfortunately, the enemy is now aware of our presence and has gone to high alert. Marvelous. You will infiltrate this chilly labyrinth and disable the outer <laughs> defense system. To do this, you must obtain all three power cores in the area. This will not be easy, mm. pilot. Gravex mines now surround the two landing platforms and automated photon turrets will shoot on site. Prisoners are held on the surface. If you liberate one rescue pod, they can provide us with vital in intelli intellifence? Intellifence. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, F and G are right next to each other. <laughs> you sorely lack. Hey, it's a new thing. We need intellifence. <laughs> It's intelligence about the fence. It's a very intelligent fence. Uh, kick the tires and light the fires. Nice. Orbit required, yes. Extracts required, one. No, <laughs> typo. That's okay. It's a funny it typo. It happens. It is a funny typo. So I do have a, um, a CRT effect on this. I think it's PVM 600 from the retro tank, just to give it a bit of a uh, bit of a look to it. So now there's turrets that shoot at Tanya. Ah! Uh, that one shoots where you're at, at the point where it shoots. There you go. Got one shot in. Oh, Sometimes so they take hard. different amounts of shots. Strafe. No. It's very hard to get it facing the exactly where you want it. Oh, this is the cart. This is the cart for Ah, no! Uh, oh my god, uh, what did you do? I didn't mean to do that. Just held down the button. No, I... So Into oblivion! Uh, -huh. <laughs> uh This is the cart version. Uh, this reminds me how bad I am at Gravatar. Not your playing, just the style of game. <laughs> oh, you oh, destroyed it? It's, it's, yes, I did. Oh, okay. I did manage to destroy it before. So, the, I'll tell you what's on the screen. Um, so up at the top left is the energy slash fuel that you have. And every time 
You use a bit of fuel for the side thrusters or the bottom thrusters. It goes down. Uh, there are buttons that you can trade off bullets for energy. Um, so if you have lots of bullets, oh god. Ugh, I, I find it so it's so hard. I would to stay, get these guys. stay from the. S ah, ah, oh ah, my god! Light touch, pass. feather touch, feather touch. It's so hard. Sometimes it's just like forget <laughs> it. It'll be fixed in 101. <laughs> That's good. That's that's good. There's fixes. So you too can get the limited edition 1.00 version with the uh, with the uh, spelling mistake. Oh my God, where am I going? You're going to the teleporter, which is fine. You probably have to <laughs> have to rescue some other guys. That first level uh, was very smooth. Walk in the park. Yeah, it's not usually that smooth um, <laughs> for me. <laughs> so the left and right turn the ship. There is a button um, that automatically centers your ship upright. Yeah, C. Which is the C button. Because it is hard to get it perfectly straight again. I don't know if the rotary controller might be a little bit easier. Order quickly! Rare! Sealed! Get it graded! <laughs> By water! <What? laughs> put it in put it in a box forever. Um, oh, let's continue on with what's on the screen. Uh, your heads-up display. So that people know what they're looking at. Where is that in the manual? Just so I get all the terminology correct. Uh, mission timer. Uh, that's the time that's counting up. So you get a, a count of how uh, well you did if you want to challenge yourself and do a little bit better. Um, the top right is your battery counter, which I am not quite sure what that does just yet. Um, the bottom left is ammo. So every time Tanya shoots, it gets rid of one of the ammo. Uh, the rescue counter, see that little white guy in the bottom middle? Um, that shows who you've rescued. It turns, oh, oh there's only one. Sometimes there's turrets that can fire off a whole bunch of oh, those. Yeah. So I believe this is the rescue pod? Maybe not. Let's see if it turns yellow. There you go. Battery nope. Republic. It's the battery. Oh, the battery. Okay. Um, and then in the bottom right is your reserve ships. And the interesting part about this game, and that kind of threw us for a loop at first, is that you don't start all over. Any ship that has done something... No, 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 no. I know you're, you want your treats. Any ship that's done something before, it's persistent. So if you pick something up that... I think it depends, yeah. Oh, landing pads with arrows will refuel and rearm you as yes, well. Yes, yeah. So if you're low on fuel or ammo, that's always super handy. And they're infinite, I think. They don't run out. But they're only in certain spots. So that's not going to do any good over there. That one's empty. You already got the thing there. You got the thing there. That's the pod that you have to rescue the guy in. Yeah. Run, run. Oh, ho, 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 so close. So you get a certain number of lives to um, finish the level. Mm -hmm. um, and it'll show at the beginning how many lives, and Tanya has two left. And this is the game, a type of game where it shows the current life you're playing as well. So Tanya has this life plus another one. Ah. So there's also gravity in this. Um, in terms of things that affect gravity. I think the thing at the top affects gravity. I don't know if there's Not anything sure up there. Going. Well, go, go up. Are you trying to shoot that guy? Yeah, he's shooting at me. Shoot! There you go. It's I there's... think there's a gravity thing I up know, there. I know, I don't know what to do about that. Is, is there it anything? pushing you away? It's probably nothing up there. I... Oh, there is. No, no, that's... I don't think there's anything. You can't get close enough? I don't know, we'll see. I'm running out of energy, though. You get heavier as you collect resources. That's right. In the training uh, levels, there was a water level, 
where actually you get buoyant with more things. Um, I guess everybody's holding their breath inside <laughs> and everything's buoyant. But you had to actually turn the ship around and go into the water to get down to the bottom of the water, which was an interesting mechanic. Thank you. Uh oh. Hello. You can trade your bullets for energy. How? Uh, some one of the top buttons. What 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 top buttons? The top three buttons. Thank you. So just land and we'll do that. Okay, don't take off. Okay. What just top buttons? Those three buttons. Which these ones? Yeah. So just press it briefly. There you go. Oh, that didn't give me much energy. I gave you like no energy. Oh my goodness. No, I'm right back where I was before. I don't know how to get back. Oh, that was the beginning. Oh, I <laughs> ran out of fuel. Yeah, I ran out of fuel. Well, you kids don't stop arguing. I'm turning the ship around. <laughs> Why energy to ammo? Oh, okay. My turn. Yeah. Ammo to energy, energy to ammo. Yes. So the the top left two. Hey, are there checkpoints? There are the green ones, which energize you, give you your energy back. Also are checkpoints. Stinky cats. Or somebody cooking anything. food. <laughs> Maybe. All I smell is beer right now. My lovely hazy IPA. The uh, <laughs> cat pee bush outside the... the cat pee bush. <laughs> Outside the office is in full bloom. Yeah. What is a cat pee bush, you say? Well. Oh, Oops. heat seeking. I gotta get used to the controls again. Yeah, you gotta, of course you it's gotta gone get now, that so. right away. Uh, true. I don't know what type of bush it is. Do you? It's, a, it's a tree. Yeah. It's a beautiful tree. It has these beautiful longish yellow flowers on it. Yeah. Dark, glossy green leaves. Um, and James claims that it smells like cat pee. It does. I don't get the association. Oh, it, I, it doesn't smell that bad to me. You must have like extra some kind sensors. of extra scent gland because I don't really notice it that much. I notice a smell, but it's not that offensive to me. So I find it really funny that he calls it the cat, cat pee bush. But oh, it is. It's not that bad. <laughs> oh, it is. But I, I do smell it. It just... You really hate it. Probably because you, your office sits. Boom! Oh ho ho! Oh my god. Oh, that was very close. It sure was. Oh my god. No, wrong button. I was trying to fire. <laughs> Damn it. No, that's not, that's not the bush. It's just something stinky. I don't know what it is. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's then one day scary. that bush will not do so well. <laughs> oh! I'll have an accident. Oh, you're gonna piss off some people on the strat if you do that. Oh, they won't know. It'll just wither and die. I wonder Poor if there's bush. something further up there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like Is, to, the to the right? The left? Oh, it's too narrow. No, no. You think so? Yeah, it's not. I bet there's something there. I bet there's something sneaky. It's too narrow. You think so? Oh, now I'm so heavy. So heavy. Ah! See? There's a top part there. Oh. I bet you can sneak over. It's probably not easy. Oh my goodness. Yep. Yeah? I bet, well, maybe. Maybe that's the easiest, easy way. See that thing? I went to the left already. It's yeah. uh, gravity. It's pulling you or pushing, pushing you? Pushing. Yeah, I smell food. Someone's cooking. Stink. No, you, you, no, you're going back the way you came. What? No, that, no. Go to the left. Oh. Go to the left. Uh, oh, God. Good. No, you don't need to go. You're going the wrong way. You're going to lose energy, I think. But... I just transferred oh, some good. power. Yeah. But it's not enough. It doesn't give you much fuel. The, the, these things? The bullets. Yeah. Oh, you don't watch, get any. Watch, watch. Like, tiny, tiny, tiny bit. Tiny bit. But I guess it's just for emergencies. So, I mean, low fuel, low ammo. Low ammo. Low fuel. Yeah. But and I have then a lot there's of something left. above, but I just couldn't get. So I've rescued everyone. Now I, I so. need to turn off the shield or go yeah, back. Yeah, I think you need to find the green platform. 
but he doesn't. <laughs> yeah, clip sounds so right for the Jaguar era. It does. Yeah. So, you have to... Ugh, I can't... Oh my god, I can't lift off. Are you dead? No fuel. You have no fuel. Can you convert any more ammo? I have to convert ammo to kill myself. Yeah, so you can take off. <laughs> there is an auto-destruct. Oh, failure? Yeah. Why? When you run out of energy, I think. Energy doesn't carry over from ship to ship, does it? I don't it? know. Uh, it happened one of the other levels we did, too. Yeah, they aren't rescued until you but take them back to the pad. Oh, do you have to bring them back to your original pad? Maybe you have to bring them back to the original pad. I think so. Yes, the original mm, one there. That would make sense. Can you drop them off one by one so that you're not so heavy? Probably. I think that's... But then you're... Wait oh, oh what are you doing? That's a nice waste of... What are you doing? I have no idea. You No, kill yourself now because you have no energy. Unless you're going to go back, <laughs> pick up one guy and go back. I wouldn't have enough. Uh, no, probably not. Oh, I think that's what I've been missing is you yes. take that back to the to the original and pad. I assume there was another pad somewhere. Oh God. I know, I know, it's so hard. I mean, you don't have to kill that ship. No, but it definitely makes life easier. I think you should try and sneak your way above that thing, but that might be really hard to do. Oh, look. Yeah. And then take him back. Yeah, because I'm. Because that's what I think I was f missing. Oh, careful. Ooh, ooh. So I'm guessing. There you go, and then you get the energy ah, back. See, that's what I was missing. Yeah, that's what uh, we were doing wrong. Any green highlighted pad, but I couldn't find another green highlighted pad. Because so. then you can just do it over and over again. Right? Just get, get one, one, go back. Get and one, go you're back. also not super heavy. Yeah. So you're going to try to go up there? Oh, I don't know if you can. No, 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 no. That's not happening. Mm. I want to try that. Shot Madness again. lies there. Okay. Hmm. What's down there? Uh, oh, there is something down there. There is a... a missile. Oh. Oh. Yeah, my energy's okay. I'll get the stuff down get, here. Well, you need that. Then I'll go back and refuel. Refuel. Oh, see, it turns green when it's rescued. Mm -hmm. White when you don't have it. Yellow when Yellow you have when it. Yellow when it's on board. And then green when it's rescued. You don't have to return batteries, just rescues. Yeah. But I need some more energy, so I think I will. It probably doesn't hurt to... I mean, I, mean, I won't get a good time, but it's more about we just want completing to complete it. the levels. <laughs> right now. And show off the levels, right? Yeah. It's so beautiful, though. It is. Oh, it's so beautiful. Here it is. Lots of energy. And, it's and funny. missiles, too. Um, when we were playing it yesterday, I noticed that when you get a new ship, it's not fully refueled. So if you take you off, wait. if yeah. you take off immediately, you get in trouble. You actually aren't fully fueled. So it's kind of funny. Ooh. So, so ah, ah! <laughs> Oh, momentum. Yeah. Cool mistress. Oh, see what happened? I didn't. I didn't wait. What? You didn't get it all? See? Well. Not much more, but. Yeah. <laughs> what is he saying? I can't read it. Uh, that Fine. feature is for speedruns. Do you wait and refuel or make a dash for it and risk running out? Decisions, decisions. <laughs> right. That makes a lot of sense. Who this designed the ship without NAF cannon? Exactly. Yes. I want to shoot from below. Budget. Budget concerns. Budget constraints. It's an add-on that nobody wanted to <laughs> splurge for. you down here which I, is on the other side yeah. so if you go up you go back to where you started so you want to go to the left 
get the other guy. Yeah, to the, get those two pods. Oh, and there's no way back that way. It's a one-way teleporter. Yeah, you have to go back through. And I think I will. Because I need... Cause, and I don't know if there's... Yeah, you just need the two, right? So then you go to the left. No. No, no, you have plenty of energy. What are you doing? I'm heavier. It's, a way... it's, it's much harder to do it. Oh, right. And I'd rather have full energy, too. Ain't it safe? No, no, that's fair. That's fair. Should be more practice. Too. I feel like there should be another pad somewhere, but... A refueling pad? Is that cowbell I'm hearing? <laughs> Ding. Is it? Probably. It's ear-appropriate if it's cowbell. <laughs> more cowbell. Ah! Ah! Nope. Didn't oh, hit it. I almost got skewered. We followed. I know. Oh my God. I didn't see it Who's flash this? up. <laughs> I didn't. It's it at, didn't flash it's up. It's at the top of the list there in the middle of it. On the screen. Tamaricade. Yeah. Thank you for following, Thank Tamaricade. Thank you. Thank you for following. <laughs> Sorry, it's a little far away to read. It is. <laughs> And you get underneath this guy. It's yeah. A bit easier to shoot that way. I didn't see it flash up. Maybe it did. It does on the on the screen. Yeah. Not on the chat, but. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I, I need to enable that. So I have all three now. You go back, unless there's something to the left. I don't think there is. Is there? I didn't see anything else when you were playing. I know there's another transporter somewhere, but I don't know where that is. Well, that's the one you, you came in on, so... Is it? Yeah. Because you go around, and then it just oh, shoots you to the bottom. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay. So it's just a one, one-way teleporter. I think so. Yeah. Too much speed going. Yeah, you got to be careful. Yay! It's not the end? No. It's one more thing to do. Arcade, this game looks pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of Subterranea on the Mega Drive Genesis. Ah, I think somebody also mentioned that. So I, I think I need it's to. It's not open keep in the going. top? I, it didn't say that well, it was open. Did you open. look? No, but. It might be. I think it said every time. One battery remaining. Oh, up. yeah, so there is a battery somewhere. You've already been up there, but that's fine. I sh shouldn't bother taking that. I don't know if it really helps you. It doesn't really. It's not really a shortcut. You don't get energy for it either, so. It's not too hard to control. Nope, I'm nice and light. I I can't tell if there's something up, like around oh, this I bet thing. There is. I can't shoot. Or that, if there's I? one to the left, because I'm not sure. Can I shoot that? Oh god, no, 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 no. Oh, oh can. you can! <gasps> I didn't know you could shoot the I gravity didn't know you things. Could either. Oh, that's gonna be so much better. To Hate those gravity things. Yeah, yep. I bet there's something to the left here. Oh, Ooh. there's a turret. Oh, it's down. It's down. Yes. No, this guy. you don't need to deal with him. Get, okay. get it, get it. You can re-energize. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, you're so lucky. That's so, not yeah. a physical object. It's not a thing. Oh. so hard to time that. So, did I refuel? No, not completely. Oh, okay. So you can shoot me here, that's the problem. Eh, kind of. Whew, okay, that is helpful, I guess. So, it must be up. Just get past him. We don't need him. So dangerous. <laughs> Very dangerous. So, oh, to the right or to the left, do you think? I think it's going to be to the right, because that... Well, I should go to the left first. Oh, oh, touch too much. At least I start here. Yeah, that's good. Or down, I guess. I don't know. Did you go down? That's where I came from. To, oh, that's true. It's not up there. It's not up there. Okay. All right. So down. Not to wasting the left. our time. Down to the left, I think. Yeah, 
Thank you for not wasting our time. <laughs> oh, oh there it is. Yay. And I was like, did you go that way? No. And I'm like, yes, you, you haven't gone that way. Good. And then... Then I can go back to that one just above me. Shield is deactivated. Oh, okay. So I can just go there. Go up, yeah. Don't need to go up. <laughs> Don't hit the walls. Some of those ice skulls are deadly. Some of them are not. Luckily, there's an escape route, right? Yeah. Yes. It's not up there. Thank you, Serena. <laughs> uh, and it is your turn. Yay. Whew. Oh, let me put it in the code. Might as well do it. That was a, well. That, that was a terrible run. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> I did do it. get it in the system. Yeah. And I guess anybody could submit my score, but it doesn't matter because it's well, just a score. It's it's still associated to you, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's not like they can submit it. Three, the great energy heist. Planet Alpha, Hyperborean Nexus. Most impressive pilot, perhaps I underestimated you. The intel obtained was most valuable. Prisoners are being forced to work the mines located deep within the wind... The winding, the winding... Winding. Winding cav... <laughs> winding ca cavernous <laughs> walls that they refer to as Hadley's Despair. Needless to say, this will not be a walk in the Arborean... Arboretum. <laughs> Too many long words. <laughs> um, the narrow quarters will test your skills as well as your patience. Oh no. Uh, also, energy barriers are in play. Either deactivate them via switches or step up your fly game. Collect two power cores two plus power. two medical probes okay. to extend our sensor range. Hop to it. You notice Ooh, the uh, asteroids going by yeah. are on an arc. Nice. They're not just going straight, so they're orbiting around something. Well, it's Very like we're nice. we're on a planet and it's orbiting around us. That's what it reminds me of. Um, the pilots you rescued didn't think it was that bad. Yeah, they were very thankful. Yeah. And Nostalgia says, I enjoy these mission briefings. Yeah, yeah, they're great because they add, you know, it's not just flying in a level. It's, it's no, it's a mission that you got to do. Pushing around right. buttons, Left pushing around right. buttons. Oh, there's one right away. Perfect. Nice, easy one. It's narrow, but not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. Woo. Yeah. All these short samples that are... Um, oh, you're going to go for another one? Heavy ship. Heavy ship. It's not too bad. This I actually find the heavy ships easier to... There are always like little short samples like that in... in uh, oh this generation of games because they wanted to save space, right? So low fidelity, really short, and of course they're 90s. Rad! Cool! You did it! Like, super over-enthusiastic. I think you have to disable something. That is going to... Oh, there it is. No! Uh, <laughs> no. I, I'm, I'm already forgotten my controls. Ah, come on! I'm pushing Trigger the wrong. Happy. No, pushing the wrong buttons. That doesn't help me at all. Oh, and your guy died. Oh, did did it? Well, he's not yellow, and he's not rescued. He's white, oh, no. and he's gone. Oh no! Mission failed. Yeah, no kidding. They are orbiting something. Nice observation. Yeah, they're doing a little bit of an arc. You go down there without. Uh, no, it's 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 shooting from below. Oh, it didn't fuel up completely. Uh, okay. it. No, I don't, because I don't know. I need to, to test out seeing if I can shoot these guys. Oh, can't be true. Smell it. I don't know what you're talking about. But you can smell something, right? Oh, yeah. You don't think it has a scent of cat? Oh, my God. See, I keep pushing the wrong buttons. It's very, very, very mm. annoying. There are eight of them. Well, it's just getting used Plus to the theory. sidebars and the... He was in the ship. The ship exploded. One less rescue available. But maybe there's an achievement for mass murder for your own yeah. team. Most people killed. There might be. Well, that's why it does game overs early. If you crash with the things you're supposed to rescue. So I was always wondering, it's like, oh, it's game over, but I have like three ships left. It was because you failed the mission. Nice. Ah! 
It's probably something on... Oh, it's so hard. Low energy. <sighs> Low energy. Oh. Choplifter was like that too, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah, if you went, sat, if you uh, landed your uh, helicopter, rescued a bunch of people, but then got shot down or crashed, those people are just, they're gone. They, they don't auto magically te teleport back to their base, yeah. or, which makes sense, because if they had a tele uh, the ability to teleport, they would have done it a long time ago. No, there's nothing here. Just a floating rock. Ooh. I know. No, another barrier. But that one's crossable. Or does it go all the way? It doesn't even go all the way. Can you go in there? I think you can, because you can shoot in there. Let yeah, I see. think you're right. Yeah. So let's read a bit more. Okay, you can't touch that. <laughs> about the things in it. That's the home pad. Home pads are always designated with the three strobing down arrows above them, where you usually start a mission, it's always where rescues must be returned, where you can refuel your ship, or where you can rearm your, mun your munitions. Uh, batteries are not required to be returned to the home pad. Uh, rescue pads, there's several types of rescue pads. Two examples of rescue pads you'll encounter are shown to the left, one with a little guy on it and one with a, um, a cross on it uh, and a pod. Once you land on the rescue pad, your rescue counter will change to yellow in the lower panel to indicate a rescue or cargo is on board. You must return rescues to a home pad for them to be transported back to the base hangar. Once returned, these rescues are indicated in the lower panel by their icon turning green. Uh, battery pads. The enemy uses battery cores to power the pa planetary shield uh, above some of their locations, which prevents your craft from returning to base. Battery HUD indicator. Ah, that's why. So there's two indicated in this one. Uh, and there's two on this level. The number of battery cores required to disable the pan planetary shield is shown at the top right of the HUD. In the example to the left, a single core is needed. This one, there's two. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't know if you can pass by that. I think that's the dead end. Yeah. You mm. can't shoot that, it's a force wall. Mm. Mm. The thing bouncing back and forth, I'm guessing. Force walls, yeah. Several locations will also be guarded by, guided by force walls to enhance their security. Contact with the force wall instantly destroy your craft. Force walls are colored blue, red, or green, and can sometimes be deactivated or toggled on and off by shooting a control switch, which we haven't seen on this level. No, so. we haven't seen one yet. Scattered around the installations that utilize force walls are control switches. Force wall switches will strobe when connected. Force walls are active, and they will be static when disabled. Uh, there are blue, red, and green switches corresponding to the same colored force walls. I don't know if that's a dead end or not. Dead end. Um, some missions will require you to set an explosive on a bomb pad. Mm -hmm. Once placed, maybe I just have to drop beneath it. I think through there. Yeah. Mission My mm -hmm. turn. Gotta go through the cave. That's what I thought. Like down. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Oh, warm controller. I know. <laughs> hands are hot. Hot hands. Oh. Hi. Need more fuel. Are you gonna come and say hi? I hear he Maybe. didn't. I didn't. He didn't really come out and play all that much. You need some uh, kitten love. Yeah, some kitten oh, love and some treats. Little black. Thing little black sprite. Little black sprite. Shadow cat. Oh, it's treat time. Yeah. Oh, it's oh. treat time. All right. Well, you're gonna have to take a break. Well, mm -hmm. I'll keep going. Well, no one can see you play. Well, I'm just, I'll describe what I'm doing. <laughs> we'll switch it back in a second. Just the first couple of tricks. Oh, that was weak. That was weak. Hit it harder. I mean, he hit did it hit it. So, first guy rescued. Oh, kittens is meowing now. 
hit, hit. Oh, you hit it with your back paw. Did he? Yes. Accidentally. Accidentally. Oh, here. good. Here. I was. <laughs> I just threw it in the. Sorry, kid. <laughs> I accidentally tossed it into his game. Here. There you go. It's alright. Come on. That's the bell. definitely gonna be deadly. Smack it hard. Smack it. Got one of Good them. Good kitty. One of the things shooting, defending the base on the right. Got two of them. Hit the bell. Come here. The now bell. I'm rescuing Can the second. It? Can you hit that bell? Can we teach you to hit the bell? Oh, I bet we hit can. You'd have to do it solo, though. Can you hit the bell? Watch your brother. Smack it. We need energy. Yeah, we need to have some uh, kitten training time. Yep. He's getting getting in the way of Atari. Solo kitten training. Hit the bell, Atari. Hit the bell. Hit the bell. Can you hit the bell? Hit the bell, Atari. Good kitty. There we'll you go. go back to the game now. Um. So I've rescued two guys now. Yeah. Yeah. Shot those. Um, you rescued on the right. two. Oh, you got the ones on the right. Okay. Um, got the ones on the right. But not the force field. Uh, no, I'm doing the right hand side first. Thank you, Dan. Uh, Charles Whelan. Yeah, Charles Whelan. Thank you. you got to take care of the stuff while I'm playing. I know, but I'm trying to announce the names. Deal with the kittens. So here you go. There's one for you. Got to teach that black cat. To get through? No, I can't get through there. You can't? Oh no, it's, they needed it. Uh, we're only playing one game, so <laughs> <laughs> we kind of have to break the flow of the game yeah. to, get, uh, to do treat time. Good kitty. There you go. Little black cat needs to learn. Fuel. Good kitties. Good kitties. Thank you, Charles. The kitties, thank you. Yes. Oh, there's a bounty down there. Is there? Oh, there is. It's okay. Oh, I probably have to go down there. No, you don't. No? There's, 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 no. There you go. Good job. Yeah, there's nothing down there. It there's just comes out the other not side. Not much point in shooting that thing. No. You can stay above it. Wow. Well, it does a, track you, though. It does if, do. if it detects and you get close yeah. enough. Okay, so I have to squeeze by that. Like down? I guess. Oh, come oh, on! Snack. Oh, I was so close. I thought I was able to sneak by it. That's Force it. field is blue, purple, and white. It must be powered by the very dangerous CGA energy. <laughs> <laughs> the energy of CGA. The power of CGA. <laughs> Color graphics adapter. Mm -hmm. Go, 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 go. Oh. Ha what? How are you supposed to do that? You, you can get just past it. Just have to it. time it. Yeah. You just need to move faster. Uh, yep. So I'm not I think so much in you're the... Too, you're too in the, in the... Yeah, you have to kind of blast past it. Okay. I'll go much faster this time. Mm. See, even parallax. I didn't notice that. The background slowly, slowly, yeah. pixel by pixel moves. Nice. Yeah. So I've got three. Hopefully there's a landing pad near on this side. Because mm -hmm. that would be very, very mean if there isn't. Mean, I say. Cyrano. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see. Uh-oh. Oh, that's the, that, that, um, turns it off. The pink one off. Dead dude. Oh, you killed him. He's he's not even an option anymore. So did I turn it off? Did it's I shoot? Not it? even an off option. No, you ha you didn't have to shoot the pink thing. Yeah, but did I? No. At all? No. no. Okay. Not even close. <laughs> not even close. Thanks. It's 
Mr. Hino. I want to die in my sleep like my grandfather, not screaming and shouting like the rescues in his hold. <laughs> uh, who, who originally did that joke? I can't remember. That Which style comedian? of joke, yeah. No, there's that exact joke. In his hold? No. It, it was driving. It was driving. It was driving. I don't know. I, I know I know what you well, mean, though. Like, while his passengers were screaming. Yeah. I can't remember who did that joke, but it's a good joke. Yeah. I want to say Emo Phillips or Stephen Wright. Oh, it's definitely one of the two. Ooh. I'm too fast. Yeah. Well, we're all a little anxious, right? <laughs> uh, Especially the guy I killed. Okay, so... Go under it. Oh my god. Oh, under it and shoot Madness. it from below. If you're no. very careful. Do they have. You can go under it. Uh, but it's gravity, I think. Oh, is it? Yeah, those are. Or maybe not. I no, they're not. So. They're not gravity. They're not okay, gravity. I'll go under. I would think that would be. Just have to be very careful. Oh, there's where you're going. Uh, nope, that's transporter. Oh. I think you want to kill that first. I do. Ugh. No, wrong one. No. Damn it! Ah. Hopefully that hopefully that transporter trans me transports me back very near mm -hmm. the thing I turned off when I do. Very bad luck at shooting that seemingly simple thing. It's not even really a threat to me. I know you get through this whole point, which is really challenging. Uh, it's getting easier. <laughs> I only have through. two ships left, though. That's the problem. It's off now. Yeah, you don't kill it, you just shoot it. Yeah. Okay. Whew. It's good as um, good sounds going up and yeah. down. Deactivation. Okay, good. We're back to the start. Let's get some more energy and go to the other part. Nice. And to the, yeah, to the Where it's right. deactivated now. Should be. Let's chat some. Nothing. Seem seemingly Nothing. simple thing has two very large troublesome shields. Yep. <laughs> yep. So I think I've defeated everything over here. I think you did. Cleared I think you just out. have this part now, which the I'm pink thing gone. should be gone. And what's here? Oh, you have to go under it. Yeah. Very nice rock. That. Oh. Oh, two of them. Batteries. It's gonna make me very heavy. Heavy one. Heavy but I think two. it just. I don't know what happens. You after just have this. to go back. Go back and. Battery recovered. And once you get both batteries, I think the, the the sky opens up, so you just have to get past it. Battery recovered. Shield deactivated. deactivated. Where was the shield? It's above you. Is it? That's what it means when it shows. <laughs> shield deactivated. If I die, I die. Yeah. And I can just go up? I think so. Oh, because I'm not at the top. Okay. Yay! Woo! <sighs> Good job. <laughs> Yay! A terrible score! Like, once I just scan this in, it automatically um, Updates, submits it. Like, yeah. Because it looks like I have to type in a code? Like, there's a pin. There's, it's asking for a pin. Uh -huh. Like, select score table. Oh, my pin, probably, for my score. But do I have to, like... Go, I'm on this one. No. No, you just show up there somewhere. At the very, very, very bottom. Or not even. Just says statistics for current results, statistics for all players across all missions. No pin for submit. Okay, great. Okay. Whew. Okay, your turn for the next the one. Pin is to see your achievements. Oh, so, okay, okay, okay. Awesome. Yeah. So move to jump four. Kitten. The line must be drawn. All right. That must have made your arse pucker. <laughs> well, don't ease up yet. Long-range sensors of a detected remains of a Class II 
Shite Kov. <laughs> Koi. Koi. Yeah. Koi, a uh, science vessel located in an icy cave. Three clicks east of our position along with two rescue pods. Life signs present. Okay. As luck would have it, time is not on our side. Enemy forces are closing in on the position and energy barriers are blocking your route, which must be deactivated. And it gets worse. Landing pads are located on the canyon ceiling. Mm. Ceiling. And nearby water sources affect oh. the way the ship handles if submerged. Retrieve two pods and power two cores. Two power cores. Uh, orbit required, yes. Extracts required, two. two. Okay. Good luck with this on the ceiling. So there's. Oh my god. So you have to land upside down. Whoa, what is going on? What is going on? Oh. What is going on? <laughs> Buoyancy. You're underwater. You're buoyant. Oh my goodness. So you have to think upside down. It's all upside down. That's going to be fun. So to see... Kitten! He's doing kitten things. I know. I can't handle him right now, so. He's climbed completely up on the tripod. And now he's jumped up. Okay. Gravity and water physics, yes. No, no, wrong one. No, wrong way! <laughs> I'm turned I'm turned upside down. Yeah, everything. Oh backwards. my gosh. So the buttons make you go the way you go. So if you press right, it makes you go right. Oh, oh. Ah, no, no, no. Oh. oh, this is not going to go well. Yeah, this one's going to be challenging. Do you see that? As you go up, everything gets lighter. Just slightly more light. Ah. Very nice touch, Cyrano. Oh, this is hard. And gets darker the deeper you go. Oh, my nice. goodness. That would be very, very cruel if it gets so dark that it's black and all you have is, like, lights on your ship to guide your way. Did you do that? I bet you did. I bet everything's underwater. I know, but... Oh, no, there's a dude up there. Okay. It's five. But I don't think they're critical to the mission. They said, oh, life no, sign. No, you need two. Do you? It, it says? says you oh, need okay. to rescue two. Yeah. Squish. <laughs> I can't help but thinking of Space Taxi. Hi, little cat. Are you a box cat? Let's see if you're a box cat. So I've got a cat trap here. Are you a box cat? He's a bowl cat. Oh, oh, almost. There's a bowl upstairs that's pretty much the same size as him. And he gets in it and goes nuts. He starts scratching the side of it like he's running a marathon. It's so funny. Yeah, I guess the people wouldn't be underwater. There are lots of people on this map, but we, because we didn't think people would get them all. <laughs> oh my God, you're not getting back past that. It's good to give. Whoa. Oh. oh, did you kill him? I think you no. killed him. No, 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 no. No? I didn't okay. get him. You get in the box? You get in the box? Oh, oh this is so hard. <laughs> it is challenging. Uh, missile launchers. The enemy also placed several mobile missile launchers around their installations. If you come into range of these platforms, they will lock on and launch at you. Either destroy them or exhaust their fuel f using evasive maneuvers. You will encounter many enemy types on your missions. Our database is woefully incomplete in this area. Use your discretion when engaging them. Turrets. Those are the things that shoot the... Oh my god. <laughs> the I, little I, I just, round balls. Yeah, my brain is not wrapping around this upside down thing. <laughs> Defensive turrets of several types 
turrets will be placed around the installations. These turrets will shoot either bullets or missiles at your craft. Some are hardened installations that will take multiple hits to destroy. Approach them with extreme caution. A uh, planetary shield will be visible at the top of the map until the mission success parameters are described in the briefing have been met. Contact with the planetary shield is instantly fatal and will destroy your craft. So banging into walls isn't instantly fatal, but it does take a lot of energy. Oh, it takes, I, like, I can't, I can't. This is terrible. <laughs> Too hard. It's, it's, you're so you. buoyant. You can use the extra weight to your advantage. Ah, so you don't want to um, drop off the dudes in this. Shoot! Ah. Oh. Oh, what? Oh, wrong way! No, 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 no! No! I can't get it! I can't get it because I'm hitting the buttons the wrong way. When submerged, your craft will become buoyant and turn. rise against the <laughs> current direction turn. of gravity. Carry rescues will increase your mass, yes. allowing you to sink while submerged. Yeah. So actually getting things in this level Flipping your brain helps. around because you have to do it upside down. Oh my goodness. He's You'll do box. better at this, I think. He's nope, not a box, box cat. No. Which way should I go? Either. I think the right might be easier, but I'm not sure. Yeah. It's and then you'll you'll fly up super <laughs> fast. You can go to the surface though. Yep. See, you automatically hit the wrong way. Yeah, because you're so very used hard. to it. Just have to think backwards. I know, put upside on, down. Put on your upside down glasses and think backwards. There you go. Yeah, it's oh, super, goodness. super challenging. And of course, C puts you upright. All the way? Um, well, it puts you the wrong way for this level. Yeah. Gonna stretch your brain a bit. Yeah. Hold it upside down. Uh. See, see, it's so hard. You just want to go left and right, up and down. Ah. <laughs> what's what's the code to skip the level? <laughs> go to the surface and get the um. Yeah, that'll. Oh, oh yeah, that's not a good idea. Oops. A little too fast. <laughs> I can actually slow you, you, myself. You, you do down. have to slow your ascent, and then. Problem is, you have to slow yourself. That I have to be perfectly straight mm -hmm. to slow your ascent. Otherwise, you start going mm -hmm. left and right. Mm -hmm. Ah. Up, up, down, down, left, right. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the right code. Uh, There's a guy to the right. Let's go there. I Nobody's think you need two. You it says you need two rescues. So. You have to rescue. I know you have to bring them back to that pad. Yeah, or a pad. Maybe a there's pad. another one around. Cruelly, it's probably the only one because it's very central. Too, hey, right? how could he shoot through that? When he's off screen, it knows he's off screen and still shooting, yeah. but it doesn't register the platform. Oh, there's the thing to turn off the blue guy. What are you doing? Uh, uh, oh, down in the, le the left has the thing to, sh to turn off one of the force fields. Uh, I need more energy. Yeah. Will you sink? Yes, you only need one guy to sink. Nice, but I have to drop him off, unfortunately. Because I need energy. <laughs> I will die. You don't have to. I do have to. I'll die. Well, get another guy and then do it to sink down. Yes. It'll make it easier to sink down. That's the key to this level, for sure. Yeah, the flickering torch for the melting ice. Is yeah. Beautiful. Well, little details. Oh my god. Little details. Oh my god. Ah. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, there's the outhouse. Yeah, on the, I uh, see it now. down and around on the other side. And there are pads on the roof. Yeah. Pads on the roof. Uh. There's another guy straight up, I think. Oof. Yeah, there he is. Oh, there's the blue. So that's how you get rid of the blue. Ah. Assuming you need that. Yeah. I should do the um, water stuff now. Yeah, with with, with a guy. The weight, right? Hopefully you. Could try and shoot that blue thing. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna watch it's okay, the cat I now. see him. I see. Him. <laughs> what are you doing? Trouble. Trouble cats. Trouble in cat paradise. Are you really slow, eh? Yeah. Kind of to help it a bit. Yes. Uh, watch out. Oh. It's a very narrow path down there. Is this where one of the people are? Or the things I need to Well, get. the things are down at the very bottom, so... That's one way. And a bunch of things, too. You need two pads, I think. Two? I don't know. <gasps> yeah, it's very hard. You have to shoot a bunch of guys. <gasps> oh, no! Got him twice. But now I don't have the guy with me, so I have to get another guy. <laughs> we try the blue? I don't know. Well, yeah, there I'll might not be I'll any get... other guys because there's three no, rescues there's three and the go. other three are down below. Under the water? Yeah. No, so no. So I, no. I think I don't think there are any guys uh, anymore above the surface. No, they're not. Under the water. There are five. No, those are guys. The, but the the um the battery things are on the top right. Battery things. Those two yellow things. So there's batteries. Yeah. Yeah. There's. Their batteries are down below too. I saw one of the. There oh. was at least one down below. Okay. I think you've gotten all the guys up here. That cat is gunning for. What? Oh, where's the thing to turn it off? Yeah, it's down below on the left. Oh. I can try that. Not there. Down below. Uh, under the water. Under the water? You have to go under oh. the water. Oh. See? It's oh, there on it. the left. So you have to go down and around. Can I go through that? A, a candle. Obviously, there's definitely a way to do it. Try to just float your way over, I guess. Yeah. Oh, I've only got two ships left. Terrible. It's nice and warm on the next world. There's some incentives. <laughs> says. Oh, good. So maybe you can go up there and ah. see what's at the top. I almost need to like fuel again. Oh, did I hit that? Yeah. Straight up. Straight up. Straight up? Yeah. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, now you're in trouble. Maybe there's fuel on the other side of where that blue thing was. Oh, yeah. There's death. There's death. Because there's things there. shooting at you over there. True. Low fuel. Low fuel. Low fuel. No, there's, there's a battery up there. At least Last now you're fueled. Life, though. Yeah. kind of know how to do it now. Much better it's next off, time around. So that's good. Yeah. I think I'm gonna just go for that thing first. Get so the I can battery. just turn it off. Once you have the battery, are you heavier? Uh anything, yeah. So anything. at least it'll make the water part easier if you need to get the other battery that's down at the bottom. That's true. Good. <gasps> good job. Thank you. Before he shot another missile too. Yeah, there's another guy at the top there, I think, shooting. So? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's just that kind of guy. Yeah, I just need to 
Oh. I'm moving. It's moving too. Battery recovered. Nice. See, it got rid of. Too. It got rid of one of them. Yeah, the other one is down at the bottom of the ocean. Um. Okay. Now what? Go back into the ocean? Yeah, unless you want to try and shoot that guy. No, he's moving around. It's not too bad. Good job. That's a bit of energy, so. Is there anything up there? Is it to the left first? No. Must be to the right. I don't know if or there's anything. Just... Could be a dead end. Mm, no. Or it could join up. Oh, energy. Oh, do it, do it. I won't have to wait. Or will I? Maybe it will. Uh, I still don't get why there are vertical stripes in the screen. Retro tank issue. Are you watching full screen at 1080p? I see vertical stripes on that screen too. Yeah, but that's a minimized screen. That's squished down. Oh, I suppose. So if you're watching on a non 1080p screen, it's going to squish down the effects that I have on here yeah. and interpolate two pixels into one and it's going to make vertical stripes. <laughs> Serrano, what kind of monsters do you think we are? Of course there's a landing <laughs> pad up top. Um, I, I have looked at <laughs> this stream um, in 1080p and it looks fine. And I've looked at it at 720 and, and it not does not. Really? Because of the effects. I can turn those off. Ta-da. Maybe. Oh, oh, very nice. Mmm, hidden. Yeah. You have to bring that back to the pad. Yeah, should yeah. I? Yes. Is that the end of the game? No, you need another battery, which is at the bottom of the water. Uh, or you can take it back into the water, but I you might run out of energy, so... No, I won't. I've got lots. Yeah, you think so? Oh, in, a, in order to retrieve it, an additional one, you mean? Oh, well, the, ba the battery, yeah. So I like the weight. Yeah, you kind of need the weight, but you need to rescue two, and you've only rescued one, so. Yeah, yeah, I have to refuel. But I need to go down there anyway, so I might as well head down there. You don't need to. Why is this my last life? Yeah. So annoying. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's stuff to the right. Who's doing that? You can go to the right. Are you going to go down or...? No, I'm going to go down and get refueled. Oh, slow. Something's shooting it. Oh, I gotta speed this up. It's going to get you. No! What? Oh, no, there it is one in reserve. Okay. Okay, move the browser to the main screen. I see both vertical and horizontal stripes now. <laughs> well, it resolved the vertical stripe issue by creating horizontal stripes. That's right. <laughs> Hi. Hi. What's up? What's up, Grey Cat? Are you enjoying the game? It's like, I would like more treats, please. Maybe, maybe what some catnip. resolution are you watching at? And what resolution... Yeah, what resolution are you watching at? Mm. You don't have anything to weigh you down, unfortunately. Nope. You're gonna have to go down to the, to oh, the water. I shoot this guy. Yeah. Oh, Doing a good job. You get that weight. Oh, just missed me because it ended. It ended. That's the only reason. Now you should have more weight. 
Come on, dude, come back into my sights. Oh, you bastard. Oh, no. Are you dead, dead? Yeah. That's okay, I think we know what to do now. Hi. Yeah. You are a Oh, I've got a black cat and a gray cat. What's <laughs> going on here? So many cats. Many cats, many, many cats. cats. Hi. Okay. No parking. Cheap shot, yes, agreed. Slow down, kaploosh. Oof, oof, oof. No, it wasn't. Skill based movement. Oh, that, that was. Yeah. One shot. Oh, I didn't get my full amount of energy. It's okay. You'll have to bring it back down. Oh, you can just bring it to the top. That was challenging, though. You have to kill the blue thing first before you can get. Right. So that was the other way. Yeah. No, oh, well, you might want some weight. Meh. Yeah. You're okay? Not for this. You feel comfortable now? Yeah. Ow. before I go up, though. Got hurt. Got it. <sighs> so floaty. Floaty game. Floaty game. Where is it? Down. Down the middle? To the left? I think so. I think I passed by. Easy to land on this. No, these. not down there. It is. <sighs> oh, you should get your energy back. Oh, please. Uh, do the underwater first. Really? I don't know. I think you want to wait. I think I, I would know. get a person and then come because back. Because you down. do have to exit out the top, and it's easier to do but those without buoyancy. But I would get one of buoyancy. the people. No. No, you think so? No. Okay. Those are easier with the what's going on. Yeah, I guess that's true. If you can figure it out. It's almost impossible. Like landing on that was hard. Yeah. If I had buoyancy, it would be just as hard. I'd have to land upside down. True. Who's the guy that was shooting me before? You, did you shoot him? I don't think so. Well, he's down now. Maybe he appears later. I don't think so. He was right there on that shelf there before. There he is. No. Oh, I didn't get all my energy. What a cool thing to do. <laughs> to punish people before they... For taking off too early. It's very funny, though. At least it's gone now, I guess. I got crushed into it. The game has a scripting engine running. Maybe he isn't there yet. <laughs> that's, that's what I think. He just hasn't gone there yet. Kill that guy because he's a pain in the butt. <sighs> I wish you could you could kill him by running into him. Yeah, he didn't die. Uh, best re resolution here: sixteen hundred by nine hundred. Can't do ten eighty p. Whatever the screen is, Vitoko is looking at. So. Oh, that's, that's why. Okay. That's yeah. Why. So it has to interpolate. Um, pixels for you on your mm -hmm. screen. That's no matter why you're what, getting lines. No matter what game I'm playing. Mm. And because um, the Jaguar has a bit has better resolution than the other systems I normally gotcha. play, you probably don't notice it on the other systems because it's combining like four pixels into one, and this one is like one pixel into... Don't... <sighs> what is he even doing there? <laughs> That's too close. I should do the other side first. <laughs> Serana said in, in an earlier build, crashing into them did kill them, but the testers were doing suicide runs to clear the levels. So, <laughs> That's nope. true, because you have I like X suicide lives. Runs. Yeah. Well, you do have quite a few lives, too. So I can see why you would yeah. get rid of that smart move. Oh, it goes to the same place. Yeah, nice. Just, yeah, it, both sides, you basically end up in the same cavern. You bastard! Oh, three! He takes three! Ah, most things do, I, I think, it Ooh. seems. Yeah. Two 
two ships left. Well, you got him at least. Yeah, but I've only have one life left. Terrible. But isn't damage boosting a valid speedrun uh, strategy? Why not sacrificing <laughs> ships? Agreed. Yeah, yeah. It's valid. It's, it's very valid. But for I suppose if that's how you're getting through all the levels, that kind of defeats the purpose. So. Well, because in it's a speedrun, it resets where you are. So yeah, that it does. may not be the greatest tactic. Because <laughs> sometimes we are monsters. <laughs> Come on, die. There you oh go. Good God. job. All right, so get heavier, and then get the guy at the bottom, and then Ooh, I think... There's another guy at the top. Or is this the only... Nope. Get There's two. Depends how heavy you want to be. Wee hee hee! God, it's backwards. I know, it's horrible. That's the worst. There you go. Yeah. Got it! And then... The other one. You should be a little heavier. Oh. Are you heavier now? Can you I get am. the bottom one? Yeah, I can. Because you have to really, really negotiate that. You might want to be heavier. Yeah. No? No. You're okay? Yeah. You're still going down. Slowly. But it's at good speed. Yeah, you want to be slow. And if you get the other guy without dying... Perfect. Then you can... Nice! Remember, you only, you only need two, two rescues. rescues. You only have one so far, so you just need one, two, and then go back to the platform. You're pretty heavy. Thing? You might be able to... Yeah. So if you get the other rescue, which is up there... Um, a little bit of, now you're really heavy. There you go. Yeah. And now, if you go back, went, bloop. yeah. If you go back, yes. hopefully you can Drop get them back. off. Yeah. Then you're good. If you die, do not die. Well, game over. You seem slower now, at least. Yeah. That's and fine. you can go upright. Just use your side, guys. Yeah. It's much easier. You're not straight. You're not straight. You're not straight. What are you doing? Now you should be able to get back over. Are you sinking at all? Yeah, you yep, are. Yeah, which is good. Okay. That's what I want to do right now. It's down there. And then you can do the upper part, and then you're done, right? Because you got the blue. <sighs> you got the blue thing. You I, shot it. I don't know. I think you did. Yeah, I did. Yeah. And you can just just <laughs> yeah you did get the blue thing so you just need to get the other battery pack on the other side of the blue thing at the very top and then you should be done because you've rescued two guys yep where is it it's up 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 just keep going up there's stuff that shoots at you Dang. Yeah, the battery was the major thing down there. So should I get that guy? Or yeah, no? You can if you want. Doesn't help anything. Just waste my points. energy. Yeah, probably. I care not for points. You don't need any of that stuff. You can just keep going up. Just avoid all the baddies. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, yeah, I had one in reserve. Oh, okay. Gorgeous animation on that. Oh, it's beautiful. You just went past the battery? Oh. Oh. Did last I? Last time? Maybe you have to go to the left. Oh, you have to go to the left. Oh. Uh, I think. I'm trying to remember where it was. 
Yeah, I think it's on the other side of those stupid things. What is that thing? Oh, go up. You got it. So to the left, or up, up to the right, and then the the pad. You have to get to the pad. Oh god. No, it's dead. That's okay. I thought that was background. No. Another round. One more. Okay. <laughs> it's not an action game. <laughs> no, it's not. It is when there's like things coming after me. It's definitely action. <laughs> yeah, killing those shooting robots or whatever they are is probably the most challenging part. Yes. Because you really need to get rid of them. I need to shoot this guy from a distance because he gets close. When he sees you, he's like, hi, I want to hug you. I don't want to hug. Not from you. Oh, good job. Oh my god. Oh my god. Good for you. Yeah, but energy get the is heavy, so low. Get the heavy guy first. That's fine. You're doing fine. You're doing okay. You're doing okay. You're doing a good job. Yeah. Yeah. Now you should be a little heavier, which will make it easier to get the battery. Yeah, it is a... It's actually really good. Nice. A... You get a bit of energy, so then if you get the other oh, one... Oh, yeah, you do. Nice. What would you call this? It's like skill. I'm neutrally buoyant. Yeah. Funny. That's fine. Tactical game? It's not tactical. What would you call it? It's not a puzzle game. It's not an action game. Based. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Cave flyer. No. Yes. So don't go to the right. No, no. Go back out the Danger way. Danger lies there. There be dragons. Now you have a reasonable weight. Cyrano, thank you for the tip of doing the underwater first. Like it's done. I just finished well, the no, underwater. No, you have to you have to go back down to that pack. Yeah. Don't say it's done. Don't say it. I'm gonna Don't do jinx yourself. The blue thing no. first. No. No, too heavy. No, get those guys. Get them. Cash it in. How fast can you land on a pad? Because I know in a lot move. of thrust games, you have to be turn around, turn around, turn not around. going super fast. And it seems like you can touch down pretty fast. It, it, no, it stops flashing. So. I like how your ship changes when you go underwater. It's a it little does. bit more uh, compact. Yeah. Good job. Okay, now you need to get the second battery. Oh, 
Uh -huh. Okay. So no, I need energy. What are you doing? You don't have that little energy. Yeah. It's a black cat, but he's he's off screen. Yeah, he's been doing off screen stuff. Oh, don't be off screen. You're so cute. So small, I can pick him up with one hand. Yeah, enjoy he doesn't like can. it though. He doesn't like it. Does not like being picked up. He's like, I am my own cat. Do not pick me up. I have agency. Yeah. Damn it! Ah, oh, I didn't refuel all the way. It's okay. Too late. Don't have much left to do. Guys are such a pain in the ass shooting at me. Yeah, I know. They're so frequent. You have to get past them too. I just forget about that. Yeah, that dude just. Oh God. God. My That's energy is pathetic now. That's okay. You're much better now. I think you can do it. I do. You'll get a little bit when you get the battery. So if you can get to the battery. It's just this guy's a pain in the butt. Just get over to the battery. The battery, down below. Is down it? below, yes. <sighs> to a cat being picked up only leads to bad things. Yes, nails clips are being put in a carrier. Agreed. Yeah. That's why they're like, no, I don't want it. Well, but you have to get past your, you kind of have to kill them. They, that, that guy becomes such a nuisance. But it's down there. There you go. And you get some energy. Just check the code and it's less than 1.25 pixels per second. Frames per second? Oh. None of those are make sense. <laughs> <laughs> Less frames than one frame second. a second? It's not. What is? Confused. Less than one frame a second would be super chunky. That'd be a chunky game. Gotta kill this guy. <sighs> At least you have it now. You just have to get the hell out. Do I have it or did I explode? Yeah, you got the battery. No, it's once you have it, you have it. Really? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes, cat, cat butt, yes. I understand. Sorry, I'm not rescuing you. It's not your day. Shield deactivated. Shield deactivated. So I can just fly out. Yeah, but you have to get to the top. You have to I get past it, those things. Oh, I'm just going to motor it then. Or can you go up a side path? Like, I'm trying to shoot those guys when I can just, like, outrun them. Maybe. Nope. Oh, no. That doesn't take me a sh give me a shortcut. Hi, kitties. So black cat. Oh. Say hello, Sprite. Sprite. So sweet. Now I'm covered in cats. I've got a black cat. I've got a gray cat. I'm covered in cat fur, too. Oh, gosh. <gasps> no. Oh. Last life. Oh, landing speed. Okay. Less than 1.25 pixels per frame. Really? Wow. Seems like I've, I've landed much faster than that. Per frame, not second. Okay. Yeah. That's a lot of leeway. That's a lot of leeway, which is good. So I don't have to be... You do have to be completely upright, though. Yes. Shoot, just strafe. Ugh. Oh, not yet. The second part. Yeah. These guys are terrible. Oh, I know. I'll stop. W was I annoying you? Were you eating me? What was going on there? What's up? What's up? So cute. 
I guess you do have to shoot this guy. It's just a pain in the butt. What? How many? Three. How many? Three. Oh, good job. Then the next guy is really hard. Yeah. <laughs> he does home in on you, so. But you've shot him a number of times already. Oh, come on, shoot. Ah, oh, I'm out of bullets. Are you? Yeah. Then get the hell out of there. No, I'm gonna give myself some bullets. <gasps> what? I didn't know you could do the opposite. Okay. Oh, go, just keep going up. Straight up. <sighs> nope. Nope. All right. Now you have to be very, very precise, and I think you're out. I think you're out. No fuel. No fuel. Go. Just go. Take off. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I barely, barely made it. Hi, little cat. Ooh, just... Okay, we're gonna look at the next one. Okay. <laughs> if it's brutal, we may end it. Yeah. Um, but if it's like, okay, not too bad. Let's record that terribleness. <laughs> Yay! Yay! <laughs> thank you. I don't know about good game, but it was a game. Not so much but a score, you. just a time. Yeah. Just completion oh, to get. Kitty, 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 calm down. Calm down, calm, sweetie calm, cat. Calm. Everybody's here. Sweet kitty. Oh, I'm on the next. <gasps> Are I'm on you? The, nope, nope. Still part of the planet Alpha. So. Never let them shoot you down. Shoot us down. I don't know who you are, or, or where you came from, and I don't care. <laughs> I will crush you. And laugh is a lamentation of your peep. Lamentation. It's like mixing <laughs> Taken with Conan there. <laughs> The lamentations of your people echo through my ears. Mark my words, scum. They will be the last thing you hear before screaming in terror. I don't know what the last part's from. So it doesn't need, that was not much of information. Orbit, Orbit required. No extracts. No, you just have to... Get the heck out, I guess, or shoot him down. Oh my god! It's the boss. <laughs> okay, it's boss time. What is going on? Oh my god, Turn gravity. Quick. Uh, gravity. He has massive gravity. Oh my god. <laughs> Big ten. Oh, I don't know how you do that. You have to shoot from really far away. There, he's got gravity, so I have to use his gravity. You have to orbit around him. Yeah. Got something. Oh, maybe that was the music. I don't know. Maybe. Get too close. Yeah, you are. Ooh. So the rings work like Star Castle. Oh no, do they? I'm very bad at Star Castle. But knowing that is helpful. The the rings in Star Castle, you sh if you shoot, there's multiple mm. levels of rings. If you clear yeah, a ring, they respond. Never yeah. mind. Brutal. Cyrano J typed it out. But to get to shoot the center, you have to shoot the outside things yeah. because ah. otherwise. You'll never. Okay, think. Very strong gravity. Need a bigger orbit. Yeah, you are definitely hitting the eye when, you, when it makes that noise. Is it, oh, am I? Yeah. The brr, the oh, brr. seven. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You hear Six, that? Uh, uh. Five, four. See, my shots go further than. Oh, and that is killing, I think, the rings. I'm guessing. Yeah. Oh. Three. Boss one is a wuss. What? Seems Two. pretty hard to. No, he's a wuss. Is he? Yeah. Once you get your orbit. Yeah. Ah. One. A little big orbit now. Zero. Zero. <laughs> he has no defenses now. Yay! Watch Boss out! Destroyed! Nice! Nice explosion! Oh, down to the eyeball. Poof! Just Mission complete. Nice! Mission complete. See that sprite? Mission complete. Hey, sprite! Hi. Oh my god. Glad I was able to finish the first one in this yes. stream. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Planet Beta. In Dorian Falls, jump nice. one underwater encounters. No! 
that. Yeah, we're just going to look at this one. We're not going to play it because mm. it's a good mm. transitional ending as well. That was unpleasant. Not really. <laughs> uh, our situation has not improved much, though beggars can't be choosers. We need to alert allied forces of our new location to improve our odds. An abandoned underwater facility 12 clicks north should have enough power to get a signal out. If we're to make it powers essential, a small outpost to the west houses a munitions bay, along with a stockade. Penetrate the energy barriers, pick up two power cores, and rescue one pod. Then get the frell out. What are you waiting for? A kiss? Orbits required, yes. Orbit work hard, yes. Extracts required. So we'll just take a look. We won't, um... Ooh, pretty. Ooh, very nice. Oh, wow. Cloudy. Oh, the background. Oh, Look at that. some pink and oranges in the... It's so, so beautiful and artistic and cinematic. It looks oh, so good. Great. How, um, so good. Was this, <gasps> was, was the backgrounds drawn, um, digitally, uh, Cyrano? Or were they scanned in? I'm guessing they're drawn. Yeah, I'm they're drawn digitally digital. there. Yeah. Like, look at the vines. That was Oh, yeah, no, it looks Because they're so good. precise. Never it mind. It looks so good. Can my questions. So, some barriers. Lots of blue barriers. Something you need to shoot. Ooh, water. I want to look at that water. <gasps> look at that. Pixel art. Love it. Oh, and you actually go in there. Drawn by Andrew does oil painting, I believe. Really? Oh, oh there. Nice. So there's a teleporter. And there's a, there's a thing to rescue. Get. I'm not going to play it. No? I'm just going to look around. Okay. Because it's, it's so cool. Yeah, I might want to do the teleporter. Oh, oh. oh, so you have to... Um, oh. So you have to teleport to um, go to the thing to turn off. Probably, yeah. Because yeah. Okay. there's nothing here. It's sense. all just barriers. Oh, there's something up there's there. Yeah, thing. but it is barriers, yeah. Go through the That's teleporter so cool. to take a look. Yeah. Some new awesome music. What? I was wondering about the teleporter, where you, whether you had to land straight, straight or not. Obviously you do. But nice. You, but you can land pretty hard. Oh, there you go. You can get ah. that thing, and then you can shoot that from here. You <laughs> <sighs> But that's okay, you're not playing, right? No, I just, just want to look at, at it. Stuff. Now that I've disabled the barrier, stuff. I'll take a look at the other thing. Oh. <laughs> oh, it looks so good. Buoyancy. Boo. Water flow will push you down? Oh, will it? Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, look at that big waterfall. Yeah. Oh, gorgeous. So nice. It's smaller, it's smaller. Oh, and splashes down there. It does push a little bit, yeah. Oh, quite a bit. Underwater it does. Beautiful. There's a mm -hmm. pad. Yeah. Some Jellyfish. Kill him. Nice. One, One hit. Yay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just jellyfish. Power your way up through the waterfall there a bit. Oh, uh, uh, uh. oh another thing there. Oh, oh. enemy. right back where you came from because i probably had to be very nice yep very very nice there's wow. a swirl pool below the fall base as well nice gorgeous gorgeous game yep um, a lot of fun to play yeah. very challenging though it's very, very challenging. challenging takes takes a bit of time um but getting better at it getting much better finish the first world um thank you for making that cyrano j yeah, and everybody else in anders too. Um, yeah, and joining us tonight. Yeah. It's always wonderful when the developers uh, mm -hmm. join in on the show. I agree. And, and help us out and yeah. give a little background little, behind little, the little game. Hints. <laughs> yeah. So we'll continue that game in, in After Dark. Yes. Uh, working our way through the worlds. I think so, yeah, yeah. And uh, then I guess going to the, the what was it, pro level? 
or what was oh, it? Oh, the next level. The I next forget what it was. But section yeah. after Pilot that. Pilot or whatever it was. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Ace. Ace. That's what it was. Pilot and then Ace. Yes. Yeah. Um, so this Saturday, I will, well, will be at the Vancouver Retro Yay, Gaming Expo. Vancouver Retro Gaming Expo. And I will be moderating a uh, talk yep. on uh, homebrew game development. Nice. Uh, with DJ Mips and a bunch of other developers. Um, let me just bring up the graphic I made for that. Yeah. And you and, and you know when it is at the... Yeah, it's 7.30 p.m. in the uh, panel area, uh, which is on the fourth floor. Uh, let me bring it up. Is the talk being recorded? Good question. Yes, it is being recorded. Ah, I can tell you that nice. now. It won't be streamed um, because I just, I just don't have the time to do that. <laughs> um, so there it is. Um, Vancouver Retro Gaming Expo, June 25th, this Saturday, 7.30 p.m. Uh, for the talk. Mm -hmm. uh, homebrew game development panel discussions with developer David Galloway, which is DJ Mips, uh, Daniel Savage, and Brian Provian Provinciano. Yes. Um, and let me just get, because you might know the game that Brian Provinciano made. Okay. Um, fairly high profile game. Uh, but let me just. That's where it is. I can't show you this next graphic. <laughs> um, Grand, let's see. No, that's not it. Uh, for the NES, he made Grand Theft Endo, but let me go to his company. It's not a retro game that he made, but you probably know the game. Um, from the company V Blank Entertainment, uh, Retro City Rampage. So let me show you that website. You might know it. There it is. Um, Shakedown Hawaii, which is, I believe, an extension of it. So Retro City Rampage, Shakedown mm -hmm. Hawaii. So it's a very um, retro-looking game. 8-bit open world, 60 story missions. Um, so it was on all these platforms. <laughs> MS-DOS, iOS, Android, Apple, Linux, Windows, Wii, 3DS, nice. Nintendo Switch, Xbox 360, PS4, 3, PSP, PS Vita. So a lot of stuff. Um, so you may have heard of that uh, game. Anyway, we will be there wandering around. Oh, Kefman 2D. I own that uh, in three, Xbox very nice. 360. Yeah. Yeah, so we'll be recording the talk, and I'm going to see if I can get permission to put it on um, the Zero Page channel okay. afterwards so everybody can enjoy it. Because nice. there is an Atari 2600 developer, Excellent. DJ Mips, yeah. uh, who made Mega Man, um, uh, Arcade Pong, and Blip Football. Nice. We played. Oh, we played Football. Play, flip football. We've also played Mega Man on the show. Nice. Yes. Yes. Um, yes. I believe it's impossible to beat the boss on the Mega Man. Oh yeah. But we did play it up to the boss. That's cool. Nice. Emma Stoss is supported. Yeah. yeah. Why not? <laughs> um. So yeah, I think it opens at 11 a.m. and so we'll be there pretty much all day until the very very end because our talk is closes out the show. Nice. Yes, yeah. that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So if you're in the Vancouver area or even Seattle. Yeah. Area in Vancouver Island. Feel like you want something to do on yeah, Saturday? Stop on by. Yeah. And, it's not uh, a huge gaming expo, but it's definitely it's, gotten a lot bigger. It's gotten in the a last lot bigger. Years. Yeah. yeah. It's it's in a very nice very nice venue. convention center. Yeah. Yeah, the Anvil uh, convention center. In New West. Yeah, yeah. They used to hold it in a very, very, very dark theater. Yeah. <laughs> Like it's super true. dark, and yeah, you could barely see true. what was on the tables. Yeah. But then they moved uh, to the Anvil Theater like two or three years ago. Yeah. Oh, and it's like I so think it's been there. A, you 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 forget the two years of well, of COVID. discounting the two years of COVID. <laughs> about so, five years. About ago. five or yeah. six years yeah. ago. <laughs> Maybe I'll catch an Uber ride from PA. Yeah. No. I well. should uh, punch that in and see how much see, it is. Yeah. <laughs> Five thousand yeah. dollars! Oh my It'd be god! A bit, I'd be a bit of gas. <laughs> Just a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Uh, but it should be a fun time. They have lots of yeah. vendors, lots of retro game vendors. Yeah. 
They have arcade game set up from Capital City Arcade. Yeah, which is an arcade my we love. My favorite arcade. Yeah, which is in New West as Every well. arcade I've ever been to. Yes. I haven't been to the, some of the massive ones, like yeah. Gallop and Ghost and stuff like that. Yeah. But, um, and uh, yeah, they have retro computers set up there. They have yeah. consoles set up. There's talks. There's uh, costume contests. I think there's a pretty big retro computer community out of yes. off the island or Victoria. I think it's on the island, yeah. And they, come um, over. And they bring all the old computer systems, which is really cool. So Yes, we'll take pictures. Yes, um, definitely. Probably yeah. not video. Uh, I'd <laughs> rather we'll just see. enjoy myself yeah. than video it. But we'll we, video the talk. We could always try to do the little live stream again, like we did at the other one. Maybe. If you find something to talk about. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, maybe a quick a little live short stream on live Twitch. stream, maybe. Yeah. Um, so what's coming up on the show? We play Gravitic Mines. Super awesome. Definitely pick it up if you have a Jaguar. There you go. That's the manual. <laughs> <laughs> um, next episode on Friday with Darcy. Yes. Yes. Or uh, no, we're gonna be. No, Wait. no, no. That's not. That's after. this Friday. Next Friday. Okay. This Friday is fine. Yes, Darcy. Um, yep. Base Chaos, Elevator Game, and Mastermind. Some new games for the twenty six hundred. Um, and after our coming up, we're going to be playing Robot War 2684 nice. and Mister Yo Yo for some high scores in the A twenty twenty two Harmony games. Nice, nice, nice. And then later on in July, um, the 2600 High Score Showdown has a homebrew pressure gauge, so we'll be participating in that. And of course, all these coming up, Elevator Agent, exclusive world premiere for the 2600, Champ Game Secret Homebrew for the 2600, exclusive world premiere, Load Runner 2600, exclusive world premiere. That's going to be awesome. Interviews with Old Style, Todd Fermansky, and Chris Walton coming nice. up as well as they get their games done too. Nice. So nice, no nice, dates nice. for any of those yet yeah. because they're, we're going to do them when those things are ready. Mm. Um, so thanks for hanging out with us on a Tuesday. Mm -hmm. uh, 2D, Charles Wheeland, Metalunar7, Dan ABC, Cyrano J, special thanks to you for making the game. And he's got a one-month subscriber beside his name now. Yay. <laughs> thanks to a very generous person. I can't yeah. remember who there, who it was. Uh, Old Style, thank you for tuning in. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, he's one of the people. Interview. Nice. Uh, for Mario Brothers, uh, or Mario Brothers, and uh, some other games. Uh, nostalgic, Vitoko. Uh, Rendered Ghost jumped in right at the oh, end there, I saw. Yeah. Jumping in. Thank you for, for lurking in the background there. Uh, Tam. Tamaricade. Tamaricade, great name. Uh, Portmanteau. That's what, it's, that's what it's called when you put two words together. Yeah. Um, first time chat. Thank you for talking today. Uh, Lord Monkus. I haven't seen your name in a while. Chalcedony Mal. Thank you for saying that. <laughs> Mike Soul. Mike Soul, yeah. Miss Command. Popped in at the end. Real too. old dude. Yeah, that's it's a great. New name. Yeah. Oh, Glitched Con 2020. Yeah. I saw um, a real old dude. Azure 6502. Lots of people. Lots. Lots. Armscar Coder. That's great. Uh, and everybody else who scrolled off. Wonderful. The screen earlier. Yeah. And, uh, oh, you're very welcome, Rendered Ghost. It was uh, fun playing the Jaguar. Yeah. Um, and I'm glad people are liking the soot sprite that James put yeah, together. Yeah, super Where's all sprites? Sprite. Where did you go? Sprite yes. ran away. Oh, yeah. No. I'll have to drag him. He's like gone, gone. He's gone, gone. I don't know where mm. he went. Bad kitty. Yeah. <laughs> um, so we'll be back on Friday with Darcy, Darcy with some more Yay. games. So. Thank you for tuning in, mm -hmm. and uh, have a good week. And uh, we'll have a good weekend too. And have a good weekend for me. Perfect lurk spray. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> and we will see you soon. Mm -hmm. Bye bye. Bye.